as you can see right there on your screen, the Dow taking a leg lower here. Uh, OpenAI, meantime, just announcing the next version of its flagship AI model. This is the highly anticipated GPT-5. The keynote is still ongoing. OpenAI is calling it its smartest, fastest, and most useful model yet. Mackenzie Segalos has more in today's Tech Check. Hi, Mac. Hey, Morgan. That's right. CEO Sam Altman is billing this as OpenAI's most reliable model yet and comparing the leap to when the iPhone went from pixelated to polished. In his words, an incredible superpower that makes anyone more capable than even the best humans just a few years ago. Now, we're actually showing you that live stream with OpenAI execs that's underway now. They say the new version is available to all ChatGBT users, including the free tier and that it's significantly better at things like writing, healthcare, and vibe coding. Now, that's when you let non-coders go from idea to working software in seconds. And to give you a tangible example, I watched in real time as an OpenAI researcher prompted GBT5 to build a custom app to teach French. It built the bones of the app in seconds. But the biggest gains may not even show up in consumer chat. Developers who have tested GBT5 over the past few weeks tell me that the real leap is in enterprise, so powering complex workflows far beyond basic chat. This also ups the stakes in the race for corporate customers. OpenAI is chasing Anthropic's lead in enterprise, where its model holds a 32% market share, according to Menlo Ventures' mid-year LLM report. Now, OpenAI does continue to dominate in consumer adoption. ChatGBT just hit 700 million weekly active users versus 450 million monthly users on Google's Gemini app. All right, Morgan, I'm jumping back on that live stream now. I'm going to keep you posted. All right, please do. Mackenzie Segalos, thank you.